Hello there, I'm John Crow with my Pokemon Diamond video. In the last part, we uh, were going through Mount Cornet, realizing that we are a little underleveled, so off screen, I told you guys I would raise all my Pokemon up to level 42. And look, they're all level 42. So that's pretty cool. A Rose will still remain in the PC though, because I need back. I just want to show off this first part before we cut back to where I was at in Mount Cornet. So yeah, I'm going get, to get, get back out of the PC, and uh, I'll meet you guys back where we were at in Mount Cornet. Okay, so right back here we're at Mount Cornet where we left off. Um, our pole just wore off right there, as you saw. Um, I think we want to go the grassy route, I'm pretty sure, if my memory serves me correct. So I'm going to put another pole on then. I have Inferno up front. So yeah. I wonder if any of these empty spots are hidden items. Guess not, okay. Where did you... And then we want to go through this entrance right here. Yes, it's all go it's all coming back to me again. I have a slight realization of where I'm at right now, so that's awesome. Let's take on this Galactic Grunt though. Our time will come. Uh, a time for only us. I'm going to turn back your time to a time before Pokemon. No! Okay, I totally forgot that since um, uh, Drago doesn't need the experience share anymore because it's uh, tied with everyone in levels, uh, that I can finally give back um, the um, the Drago plate to him. So let me do that. There we go. And let's continue on. Let's take on this Team Galactic run. Team Galactic is all powerful. Only a fool would show defiance to the, the mighty might of Team Galactic. Well, I'm doing that now, so haha. Joke's on you. I got kind of lucky when Jetta froze the Golbat with that Ice Beam. So here's another item, it's an Escape Rips, and I think I now have 6 Escape Rips now. That's pretty cool. And then there's something, okay, and then there's an exit right here. So we go in and out of Mount Cornet really, but this is still considered all Mount Cornet. Um, I think, if I remember right, we have to Rock Climb here. Well, I guess I could Rock Climb and get that potential item in that rock. There's an item in that rock. Yeah, let's see if there's an item. Yes it is, it's another rare candy, awesome, very worth picking up. So now I have one rare candy now, because I used all my rare candies to help all my Pokemon get to level 42. So if I can show that off real quick that I only have one rare candy, I'm pretty sure I only have one rare candy. Yeah, I see one. Cool. So that's really cool. So you want to actually, if you want to, you know, just skip the rare candy, you can just go to the left and use Rock Smash right here. And uh, it'll, get to, it'll get you to where you need to go actually, so that's good. If you go over here, down here, down here, up here, up Oh, is there an item in that rock? Yes, there is. It's Tiny Mushroom. Nice. Nice, 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 nice. Here's another entrance. Um, this is just a... You, this you, isn't really the place you want to go, but it's like to battle more... To battle more um, Team Galactic Grunts, I think. So, let me just put another repel on. Okay, it's off the very top of my bag. You know how that goes. Wait. Is this the right way to go? I think, yeah, this is the right way to go. Okay, I want to show the other way where you can just battle out Team Galactic Grunts if you, want, if you want the experience. Which I'll probably take advantage of. Dang it, what's in that rock over there? Nothing, okay. Is there anything over here? Nothing but another rock, okay. Um, As I'm looking, I'll just go the way. I'll skip out on those Team Galactic Grunts. I think there's a way I forgot that where they're at, but... It's okay, because those Team Galactic Grunts don't really matter. Let's battle this Team Galactic Grunt, though. 
our boss is going to do something huge at the summit, but here I am dealing with some pesky intruder. You sh you spoiled the, the atmosphere. You could lose quickly, right? You can lose quickly, right? We'll see about that, but not really. That was an easy battle. Ah, oh. oh, that bronze song was level 42, so I still have a pop, right? Yeah, so that means, yeah, I couldn't repel off that bronze song that I just battled. So here's another Team Galactic run. Let's take him on. Team Galactic will take control of everything. You can tell, you can try all you want, but you can't do anything alone. That was a fairly easy battle. Power up, let's put another one on. And we're almost to where we need to be, so that's cool. Yeah, let's take on this uh, Galactic Run right here. You, you've worked so hard to get here. I should be, you should be proud of yourself. And now I'll spend you, I'll send you packing home with only that happy thought. That's not very nice. Okay, I think this is the last Team Galactic Grunt up until we get to um, Spear Pillar, of course. So I want to do a um, double battle here. I'm going to switch uh, Karen to the front, so that way I can use Dragos Earthquake and Karen won't get affected by it, affected by it at all, because you know it's a flying type Pokemon, half flying type Pokemon. So yeah, let's take on the, um, t I guess, best of the two Grunts um, in a double battle. Something huge is going to happen, I think maybe, right? Don't meddle around. Of course, you're going to, aren't you? That's why the two of us will team up to take you down to the ground. Okay. That was a really easy battle. Well, this, uh, yeah, well, this was, well, that was pathetic. Um, we're g just gonna let you pass so you can get pulverized by our bosses. Okay, so I'm gonna end the part right here. So this has been my Pokemon Demon Redo Walk the Good part. The next part will take on whatever lies beyond Spear Pillar here. And hopefully put a stop to Team Galactic's evil ways. So, and yeah, so this has been Jonko again. I would like to thank you again goodbye and hope to see you guys in the next part of my Pokemon Diamond video walkthrough guide.